Hello everybody, Fiasco and Haley. here back at Disney Springs to head up, hit up Marketplace Snacks just like I said we would because they have the new strawberry chocolate swirl Valentine's Day Dole Whip available just for February. So we gotta hit that up, we gotta check it out. We're really excited to do that. Before we dig in though, let us let you know these videos here on the Disney Dining Channel, they are brought to you by Dreams unlimitedtravel.com let our travel experts help you plan that next vacation all that information and more down in the description below but happy valentine's day let's get our sweet tooth satisfied let's go all right we are socially distanced in our secret spot it's in behind wolfgang puck express don't tell them that yeah the, se the secret's out but uh, mass off because we are away from everybody sitting down ready to eat this. And I am getting quite good at uh, getting it here before it melts, but it's it's considerably hotter today than it was last time we reviewed a Dole Whip. So uh, we better start getting at All it. All right, you want me to take the first bite? I yeah, guess go I Yeah, go for it. Okay, it's a chocolate and strawberry swirl. And this was 549. Mmm. That is already a lot better than the watermelon. Let me see the strawberry though, because before we were saying the watermelon was kind of like an Italian ice flavor. Let's see what the strawberry is like. I like that it's not too sweet. It blends in perfectly with each other. Like it complements each other really well. Chocolate obviously tastes like a, a soft serve chocolate, but the strawberry is like a super simple, light, refreshing strawberry taste. Very, very natural almost. And the strawberry is way more similar to the Dole Whip taste and texture as a regular Dole Whip. The watermelon really wasn't hitting that Dole Whip mark in my opinion. This is getting a lot closer and as reference, within the past 10 days or so, I have eaten both the watermelon and a regular pineapple vanilla swirl Dole Whip. And this is definitely, it's obviously two different flavors in the pineapple vanilla swirl, but as far as like the quality, of the ice cream itself is much closer to Dole Whip, I think. Yeah. And another thing I should mention is when I went to pay, they asked me, do you want it as pictured or just the ice cream? So you can do that. Um, and I said as pictured. In the picture though, they had these little Valentine's Day rock candies surrounding the glass. Oh yeah. Those aren't here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so they gave you the strawberry, so they got the chocolate-covered strawberry here, which I'm going to let Haley have. Why? Because that's her favorite thing. It's one of... I like it a lot. I do. I do like chocolate-covered strawberries. Now that I tasted the strawberry a little bit more, I wouldn't say it's very natural. I think that was the wrong word to use because there's nothing natural about this ice cream. It's... Mm, I think it's kind of a natural strawberry It is flavor. a little bit. I mean, it Much kind more of, than the watermelon. It almost tastes like a mixture. I'm, I'm not very good at describing food, so I apologize in advance. It's, it's kind of like, it tastes a little bit like candy and a little bit like a, a natural strawberry flavor. <laughs> you can get anything from that. I, I apologize, but it's really good. No, this is really good. It's so delicious. I think it is, I agree with what Corey said. I think it is much tastier than the watermelon one. I could definitely see myself getting this again over the watermelon one for sure. But this is limited edition um, Dole Whip. This so is the month of February for Valentine's February. Day. Um, another good thing, like I mentioned in the watermelon video, the ice cream here is dairy free. There's not dairy, mm -hmm. they don't use dairy to make the ice cream. So that's great. If you're lactose intolerant, you can still dig into this ice cream just fine. Just keep in mind the strawberry chocolate, that, that is regular chocolate. Uh, but like I mentioned, when you go to get your ice cream, you can say, you know, hold the strawberry, which we opted to not do. And Haley is gonna let's take have it now. a bite of this. This is very messy. It's, very it's pretty. melting. It's got like sparkles and stuff on. Yeah, a little close up there. A little sparkly action. I'm gonna take a bite of this. What do you think? Mm, okay, I, I, like right away, I was like, um, the texture's a little funny. I didn't really get like um, a very strong chocolate flavor, but as, I, as I'm as i tasting it, the, it, it almost tastes like dark chocolate. I'm not sure if they use dark chocolate it's or not. It's for sure dark chocolate. Yeah, yeah. Um, it definitely tastes like dark chocolate. It's not my favorite chocolate covered strawberry in the world, but it definitely is good. And 
I'm gonna keep eating this. But before I do, <laughs> I wanna mention something. Um, so he said that this is dairy free. I wanna just quickly show you something that I get from Starbucks and it's a favorite of mine. I pretty much get it all the time, but I spiced it up a little bit, literally spiced it up a little bit. So I have here, it's um, an ice cream tea latte um, with coconut milk. You, this is dairy free, 100%. And I added a pump of chai. And it is, it almost tastes like, like a very creamy, delicious cinnamon chai with a little bit of like earthy notes to it. All that with no actual cream. With no cream at all. And it's so, it's like, it has a little bit of a thick consistency, but not too thick, but it, it just like, it's just so delicious and so refreshing. And it, you know, green tea is not bad for you, so. Let's say this over like a maybe a vanilla ice latte or something. Have something a little bit more. It's not very sweet, which I do like. If you like sweet, sweet, sweet drinks, I would not go for this. Or I would ask for like a bunch of sugar in it or something, or like a bunch of pumps of like your favorite vanilla or whatever. But this is delicious, and I'm gonna enjoy this. I figured I'd just tell you one of my favorite things I like to get at the Starbucks here at Disney Springs. And I always default to Haley on when, so what we're good. ordering at Starbucks. She really knows knows her Starbucks yeah. drinks. I don't, so I basically just say, you got it, order always, for me. <laughs> I order, always order like a, a fun drink or like something different or my absolute favorite, a matcha. And I'm, you're just like, just order me one. Order me, what, order me whatever you're getting. <laughs> it's so good. So yeah, back to this ice cream though. I love this. This is so much better than the watermelon one. And honestly, is a contender right up there with all the other regular Dole Whips. This is great. I, I, and I would say, I'd say go out of your way and get this for the five bucks. Oh yeah, definitely. Especially since it's not here all year round. I would say definitely grab it at least once. And I think it's obviously enough for one person because I had a couple bites and it's literally almost gone here. Oh, so good. <laughs> so I'd say maybe get your own. <laughs> and don't share <laughs> and then the last video i mentioned the watermelon was good but it was a little disappointing it wasn't as good as i would hoped it would have been mm -hmm. this is just the opposite i came in here expecting something similar to the quality of the watermelon dole whip and was surprised and blown away honestly this is better than i expected so and it's not like you don't want to share with me <laughs> it's literally i think i i'm i'm having a great time with the strawberry and my matcha i'm letting you enjoy the ice cream oh, it's so good it's so good but anyways guys leave us a comment down below if you tried this again it's only going to be available for the month of february this is the valentine's day limited time dole whip i highly recommend it Haley highly recommends it grab it let us know if you grabbed it and uh we'll see you in the next one